Hello and welcome back to the channel. Um, this channel is uh, about motorcycling and uh, amongst other things, um, but primarily about motorcycling and I've been doing a series of my route app tutorial videos. This video is uh, video session or lesson six. I this video was going to be about, po about points of interest, POIs, but having looked at it this morning, to be quite honest, I hardly ever use POIs and I find them really boring so it's it's uh, I'm going to try and make it a little bit more interesting and this video is about joining two existing routes together so <coughs> excuse me so the first thing I'm going to do is go and create two sample short quick sample routes if you haven't seen my video on how to create routes in my in my route app then click it'll be in the there'll be a, a link to it in the description below so let's go and first of all make uh, uh, a couple of routes. As you all know from my other video, I don't actually do it here, although you can do it here. I've already got it shortcutted. I go to my, all, my list of routes here and I'm now going to create two new routes. So I'm going to create a new route. I'm going to call this um, uh, test route one. I'll make it private for now because I don't need the world to see it. I'm going to delete it anyway. So this is test route one. So test route one, let's just go and make a quick um, video, a quick route on test route one. And I'm going to call this route and I'm going to find the first place I'm going to put as, um, I don't know, let's say Swiss, Swiss Cottage in London. There you go, that one there. And then I'm going to be going to, oh, I don't know, let's say I'm going to be going to Hendon, London, not far away, down the A41. So that's the that's our route number one. Okay, so this is I'm gonna, just going to save this, and well, it's all automatically saved. I don't I'm not going to put in route shape points at this point because for the purpose of this video, I'm going to show you how to join two routes together. If you get this coming up on your screen, by the way, it's just because it hasn't rendered yet, and you can just go and click on something like Google Maps, and it will go and fix that for you. So now I'm going to go back to my routes again um, and you'll see test route one is there and I'm going to create another route called, funnily enough, let's let me think, shall we call it test route two? Let's do that. Oops. Test route two and I'm going to make that uh, like that and I'm going to make, uh, make my starting point. Hen H E N D Hendon London, and then I'll make a, an end point being oh I don't know let's say um, let's say um, Stevenage there so that gives me my my other route uh, voila remember I said before if it doesn't render properly just put put the Google Map overlay on and it will sort it out. Okay, so now I've got my two routes, and I'll just go back to my my list of routes which I have here, just to show you. I've got a test route one, and I've got a test route two. So I'm going to go and open up my. It doesn't matter which one, um, and I'll show you why in a minute. So I'll go and open up the test route one, and from my side menu, which is this side menu here. If you don't see this and yours looks like this in your My Route app, it's just because you haven't clicked the arrow for the side menu or for the side bar. So just click on the arrow for the side bar and then we want this here. Now this is no use to us because this is this route. So we're going to click on these three lines called a hamburger menu and you pop on there and you come down to where it says uh, routes. And at this point I can add a route to this route. So remember this is test route one and I want to add the, the, the route I've called test route two to it. So I just come along to here and there you go, there's test route two. My route app do a really good job of breaking them into different colors so you don't get confused. And the one that we're on right now is grayed out. It says they're already visible. In fact, if you try and click it, it won't let you. So I'm gonna click on that, <coughs> excuse me. I'm gonna click test route two and I'm gonna add that. Now it's gonna say in a minute, so there's test route two. I want to add it and it shows you there already it gives you a preview of it it's not editable at the moment but I'm going to click on the add button and it's going to ask me if I want it to be at the beginning or the end of the route 
and I want it to be at the end, sorry, I want it to be at the end of my route there. So after one, it carries on. And then I just click on the button that says merge. And that will then go off and it will merge my route going all the way from Hendon in North London all the way up to um, Stevenage up here. Now, so let's go back to the waypoints again. If you look, it goes there to there to there to there. OK, we've got a duplication of one place, but it doesn't really matter. Um, if you look, it's renamed it anyway. It's gone from one to three. So it missed out number two and on it goes. So I can click on number two and it's there. Click on number three and it's exactly the same place. You could get rid of one of these because one's actually overlaid the other. So I could just go and get rid of one of these and it then becomes like so. So there we go. Um, that's how you add two parts of a route together. Nice, quick, easy video today. Um, in the next video that I do, I'm going to be doing on a, a video on how to split up routes. So if you've got a long journey, like I've got a journey that takes me all around the south of Devon and, um, and Cornwall. So uh, I want to break that up into days and I'll show you how to do that in the in another video, probably the next video. But that will be a much longer video. So, you know, get yourself a cup of coffee, glass of wine, uh, a pint of beer, can of beer, whatever it is that takes your fancy. Put your feet up, watch it with the earphones in while somebody's doing something else. So there you go. That's how to add um, um, routes to your join two routes together. I am not sponsored in any way by my route app. There's a link in the description where you can buy me a coffee if you liked this video. Please do feel free to also like the video, as in click the thumbs up and subscribe if you want to. You can always unsubscribe later if you decide you don't like me anymore. So thanks a lot. Thanks for listening. Enjoy uh, this. I hope it's been some use to you and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers and bye for now.